A shadow three horse gooseneck with living quarters. Roughly, I don't know, six or probably closer to eight foot short wall here at Halet RV. Just came in on trade. Um, saw a little trailer. You know, if you're uh, not looking for the big slide out living quarter, uh, you know, if you're not looking to get invested top dollar in something, it's a decent fit. Uh, looks like it's a little closer to seven six tall than seven. The fact that the uh, fenders are outside the body tells me it's uh, about seven wide, maybe six nine, but close to seven. Um, this is a little bit different. They have this little uh, outdoor closet here, and that's exactly what it is. It's an outdoor closet, and uh, it looks like they had just kind of used it for random storage. Right here, this is the table that you can use for the dinette on the inside. This is just very unusual and unique, so I wanted to make a point to uh, you know really show you that. Now, one thing I do like is full running boards on here so you can get to all your windows and whatnot. That's a little uh, sewer hose holder right there. Handy little spot for it, actually. Um, all of your windows open. You notice there is a drop-down feeder window even here in the escape door, and the escape door is exceptionally wide. That's kind of something I like. Um, God forbid in an emergency, I hope you never have to do it, but you could lead a horse out that door if you need to. A lot of small escape doors, that's not an option. Um, you know, big tires on here, and the tires look like they're in good shape. I don't, you know, see really dry rotting and things happening here, and there's plenty of tread on them, so I think that uh, you've got some good rubber on those tires. Uh, we do have swinging barn doors, no ramp. That's just kind of one of those 50-50 things that seems to be more of a personal preference than anything. Um, however, if you're, re if you're really liking this trailer, but you just wish it had a ramp, that is something we can add. We could just put a ramp over the barn doors. That is an option we can perform for you here in our service center. And if not, no big deal. The uh, bike type um, you know, holder racks right here, I have a feeling these folks maybe did some um, you know, casual or, or semi-serious uh, you know, buggy or you know, small cart riding or racing. Three horse slant with a, uh, a finished off interior roof. I don't know if you spotted that, but you, you don't see the skeleton in there. So it's, it's been finished off and probably insulated a little bit. Uh, we do have a stud wall on that front divider in case you got a little bit of lightning in a bottle, you know. And this does have an extruded aluminum floor. If you uh, clip through the pictures, I lift that up and you can see where it is a ribbed flooring to add some extra strength. Now, like I mentioned, all of your windows open, so these two giant windows on the butt side, they're 50-50 sliders, so you can uh, get a lot of airflow back here for your animals. I like the tie-downs. I like that little mirrored look on the tie-downs. You don't generally see that. Stepping inside real quick. First thing I noticed when I came in here was just the immediate sound dampening. That's because it has a soft touch ceiling liner. You can see my fingers in that there. Um, that's going to do wonders to keeping it quiet in here. That's especially useful if you have a horse that likes to chatter at night. Uh, you know, if you got a couple of them tied on each side of the trailer and they like to sit there and talk to each other, so to speak, you'll really enjoy having it a lot quieter up in here. The sofa looks like it's virtually never been used. That can fold down into a sleeper if you'd like. There is storage below it. Um, all of your windows inside are going to be pull-down shade windows versus metal blinds. Um, and there's actually a lot of handy little outlets sort of scattered around here in different positions that you generally don't find in a living quarter trailer. Um, you know, with everyone having things like smartphones and tablets and all kinds of GPS devices now, it's nice to have a way to keep those charged when you're on the trail. You know, especially if you're going to be off the beaten path quite a bit. Um, four cubic foot refrigerator that is gas and electric naturally and uh, it is worth mentioning that your living quarter up here does have air conditioner so you can stay pretty comfortable in here now the uh, the way the bathrooms laid out it really wasn't extremely conducive to taking still photos that's one of the big reasons I wanted to put this video together here is you just couldn't get a feel from the photos what we were looking at now this has an extra large shower um, and it also has the full-size vent fan above the shower to really keep the air flowing in here and keep it comfortable. You also have a floor-to-ceiling shower wall surround. Um, that's just, you know, the white paneling here. And uh, you notice it's also a one-piece shower. There's no seams. That means there's nowhere where it can fail and leak and get into your walls and your floor. That's an awesome feature. Absolutely awesome feature. 
Um, I don't know how well this is going to work. I don't really have a lot of light here. But there is an extra large cabinet. There we go. Extra large cabinet right across from the toilet. Perfect for just extra clothes. Um, you know, it's good for a linen cabinet right here. The uh, folks that owned it had uh, installed a little hanging clothes right here, but man, they did a nice job of it. And, you know, they used real wood. They didn't use particle board to do it or anything like that. So all in all, very nice piece. It looks like it's been, uh, you know, used, but not abused. And that's, you know, what you want to look for in a uh, pre-owned trailer, something that someone had put through its paces. And if there was anything that needed to be worked out, they found it, they took care of it, and you just get a trailer with a good price tag to take home for your animals. So give us a call, 800-256-5196. Halet RV of Coldwater, Michigan. Thank you, everybody. Happy trails.